You're watching CES Live, powered by Ustream.tv, the most powerful way to stream live video. And by Utech, makers of the TriCaster family of broadcast and streaming systems. And now, CES Live. Welcome back to CES Live 2015. Who are you? Rene Ritchie. I'm Adam Zeiss, or the other way around. Boom. Yeah, and this is CES Live. We are continuing with wearables right now. We still haven't found Callie and John. I imagine that John is right now parasailing off of the roof, uh, these escalating things. But we're doing uh, tons of wearables. What are we doing next, Adam? Tell we're, me. We're doing all about wearables. We're here with Jake from Athos. Did I say it right? I know you just told us how to say it. Uh, you got it wrong. Right. Like, I'm just going to pronounce it. The time wrong. it took right, Dave Curley to run the intro, you messed it up. Soon. I just won't say the names of any of the products anymore. <laughs> Athos. Did I get it right? You got it right. Perfect, you see? You're Canadian. Be a pro. Uh, so it's, what we were just talking about, we're into wearables now, and this is more wearable clothing for uh, exercising, working out, and things yeah, like that. So absolutely. go ahead, give us Stay your spiel. Yeah, so what we do at Athos is we make compression gear that you would work out with normally, uh, sweat, whipping, sweat wicking fabric, excuse me, that you're used to, machine washable, dryer safe. Uh, the difference with our shorts, we make shorts for men. Nice. And uh, capris for women. We also have, we capris also have for shirts. You, Renee. There you go. Something for everybody. We also have <laughs> shirts. Um, we're going to be demoing the shorts out today. The difference is what we do is that we have sensors actually built into the clothing that uh, read your muscle activity. Okay. And it uses a science called electromyography. So from that we can tell what your muscle is doing from zero to 100%. So let's say you're doing a squat and you're using your quads. How much of that quad you're using? Are you building muscle? Are you toning muscle? Are you using the right muscle for that exercise? Uh, all of that good stuff. We can, we can play a virtual trainer on your phone. Uh, we also get heart rate from the lower body. Uh, so no more heart rate straps, no more shirts. You can just wear your shorts and be good to go. And that's and how, something unique to Athos. What range of sports is good for? So for example, I do a lot of grappling. Can I wear these while I'm grappling? Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. So um, really, any, if you think about it, any athletic activity is a result of what your muscles are doing. That is the cause. So if you're doing a successful move in grappling, you want to know why that happened. Or when you're unsuccessful, Again, why that happens, you can change it. So are your muscles getting fatigued to a certain point? Are you not using the right muscles in the right sequence? And so you can learn all of this stuff um, just by wearing our clothes and going to work out. We're very focused on not disrupting your routine. We don't want you to do anything different. Go to the <laughs> gym, work out like you normally do. If it's boxing, if it's grappling, if it's biking. Bartending. If it's bartending, <laughs> one of my favorite pastimes <laughs> as well. Only workout I get. I, I, I test it all the time, don't worry, Perfect. it works. Those bottles aren't light, Adam. Yeah, no, no a lot of bicep curls. Absolutely. And, um, and so it, it all comes back to that, to that main point. Go work out. Uh, wear these clothes like you normally would, throw them in the wash, forget about it, and we just give you an actionable step in between, which we'll show you in a little bit. Do I need a shirt and pants, like a matching set, or one you, or the you, other? You or don't. Both? Um, they're meant to be worn differently. You can wear them at the same time. Mm -hmm. It depends on your activity. You're doing something like a CrossFit, where you want to do everything all at once, mm -hmm. then yes, you, sh you need to wear both, because the sensors uh, monitor the muscles they're, they're touching sure. on the skin. Um, but you can wear the shorts, or you can wear the shirt. Okay. Um, and this little guy, Yes, yeah, so this Plugs is, the, in there and this is what we phone. call the core, okay. um, and it is essentially the brains of the system. So the core attaches into the shorts uh, just like this, very easily, and what it does is, is it reads all the signals that the sensors are sending to it and understands it and sends it to the phone via Bluetooth. Um, the core also works with all Athos apparel, so you only need to buy one, and everything Athos you buy, it, it works with, and you can switch it out between top and bottom, it automatically knows what it's doing, you don't need to repair it, anything like that. Okay. Digital Phil is saying eventually you can just have one of those in any, any of your clothing. Yeah, in the future, that's where we think that, obviously the industry is heading, right? Everything's smaller, lighter, everything that's going on, obviously battery technology makes that possible, so sure. in the future, that, that's what will ha be happening, but you know, for the next couple of years, this is the, the system we go with. And I'm presuming like, this is okay if you sweat, it's okay if it's like, oh, yeah. you're in a light rain, oh, all of that course. Kind of yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, obviously, anything, uh, anything workout-wise, you're going to be hopefully drenched in sweat if you're working hard, <laughs> and, and they're machine washable too, so uh, waterproof, no problem. Just not the little little puck, is it? Uh, yeah, so this is also waterproof. Wow, uh, nice. Are you try triathlon yeah. in these and have no yeah, problem? Yeah, so it, the only thing it won't do is swimming, so it doesn't record oh, okay. the signal swimming. Um, I can take it in the water, though? Yeah, just exactly, yeah, yeah, absolutely. It just won't it, count. It just, it just not won't that count. I plan on doing a triathlon <laughs> exactly. anytime yeah. soon. Yeah. Absolutely, that's not my testing department either, but yes, if you wanted to. It connects to your phone, correct? Yes, it connects to your phone. So. Um, what we have here is the screen that starts when you plug the core into the clothing. Automatically happens. We give you three goals, uh, get lean, get toned, get strong. It goes from the traditional, um, traditional sense of less, 
less uh, weight and more reps will get your muscle more toned versus building it. Um, so lean is a lot more cardio, toned is a lot more, is in the middle and strong, you're doing a lot more weight and less rep. And so it's your workout goal. And from that we can tell you what you should be getting for your muscle score. So again, that muscle effort score goes from zero to 100%. So you want to build muscle, you want to get strong, you should be getting 80 to 90% muscle score. Um, now our boss pre-ordered this amenity saw it, and then, and then a bunch of other people started pre-ordering them, <laughs> yeah, and it started almost like a domino effect. I appreciate that. You guys, I was wondering where all those orders from Canada were coming <laughs> He from. made sure everyone guys. told you that he pre-ordered it, yeah, how, I really, how badly really he's looking it. forward to trying so it So I actually have a, a pair on under my jeans right now, okay. you do, and you, so you can see Oh, right so you're here. like Superman. You can actually wear this <laughs> underneath your... You're like Iron Man? Yeah, absolutely. So you can see oh, what wow. my muscle effort is in real time for very how cool. my squat form is, which sure. according to the app is a very good. So the squats, <laughs> uh, the- Firing all the glutes. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> well, it's been walking a lot today. So the color scale goes from zero to 100%. Okay. So if you look, if I was to squeeze my right quad here, it goes from a yellow, oh, that's crazy. blue, yellow, orange. This I is really like science fiction. I used to see this to on red. TV. And so you can easily see what your muscles are doing at all times. Now, we don't expect many people to be able to actually look at their phone when they work out. That's not very <laughs> practical. As you see, when we air play it, it looks awesome. We know people that do that. But we have what we call a set analysis view. So if you think about how you work at the gym, or like you say, you do a grappling session, the way you get coached is in between those yeah. sets where you can really focus. So I can look at this and have a summary of what I just did. So it says, again, my primary score, 70 to 80, that's what I want to get. Um, and it said what I did for my left and right side for each muscle. And so for squats, um, I want my quads first and my glutes second, but my glutes are close second. So I didn't use my glutes enough. I obviously use my right side a lot more than my left side. Uh, which I have a, a little hamstring injury, which makes sense. But you could, if sense. you have a coach or a trainer with you, they could be monitoring you as you're doing the, Absolutely. they could be getting live coaching with yeah, you. Yeah, we have people doing that as well. That, that trainers love it um, to be able to have another set of tools to really prove out to their, to, to their uh, customers what they want to do. And that's been a big help. But for people who don't have a trainer, if I do this one set of squats and I look at this and I go, oh, okay, I know I need to be more balanced. I know I need to do more weight to hit my goal. And I use my glutes more and I can go right back to it. So you can um, train yourself, Adam. Step. I can try. Yeah, that's, that's, that's so what we want. Ben Routhing <laughs> in the chat room wants to know what sizing? Is, is it coming big and tall? Is it coming petite? Yeah, so right now as we first go out in the marketplace, it's standard sizing, right? So we do extra small all the way up to double XL for, uh, for guys and for girls it's extra small up to large. Um, and the sizing with their sensors in here, uh, there's no wires in the clothing either, okay. um, but we have a sizing chart on the website, but it's pretty basic too. If you're no normally a medium for shorts, you're going to be a medium with us. Okay. All right, and what's the availability like? Uh, so right now we've been in pre-order, you can reserve yours now. We're just starting to get them out the door. Obviously we ship up, uh, we ramp up shipment, it's not like we can clear all of them at once, unfortunately, <laughs> I wish we could. Um, so we're taking this in slow batches and moving towards GA. So we're start just starting to get them out the door. And, and what's the different pricing on the capris versus the shorts and then just the unit itself? Right, so um, the capris and shorts and both shirts for men and women are $99. All of our okay. clothing is only $99. Okay. So if you look across the marketplace at a Lululemon or a Nike, it's very competitive. Lululemon sure. pants are like $120. <laughs> um, the core, the hardware unit is $199, but okay. again, that's a one-time purchase. So if you were to buy a, you know, a wrist wearable and a good pair of pants, then it would so actually- you don't need expensive. one for the shirt and one for the pants? No, you can flip them back and forth. Okay. No problem. If you want to use both at the same time, though, then you got to get both. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, exactly. So uh, we wanted to approach it as, how do we make this as cost effective as possible? And so by having the lower price item, hey, you can have many of as many of, and having this sure. as the centerpiece, that was the way we were able to do that. And what about battery life and charging for that? And Absolutely, so it's about 12 hours continuous streaming battery, okay. and um, it takes about an hour to charge. Okay, so that's not too bad. So no, I can no. take it to the gym for my full workout? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, it's about, meant to be about a week, two weeks of working sure. out, uh, and then you'll be good to so go. So I assume you've been using this for a while now? Yeah, I've been one of the lucky ones to be using it since, uh, today's actually my one year anniversary at though, so I've been using oh, it nice. back to when none of this stuff looked nice, <laughs> there wasn't an, an app just around. Some duct tape and wires yeah, on your exactly. So what's, like, just between you and me, no one's listening. Yeah. Chat room's not listening. No what's your <laughs> favorite thing with these? What's your favorite activity to do with this? I have two favorite activities. So I'm a soccer player uh, nice. before, before, this, uh, before this job, and um, so I love playing soccer in it and seeing it's amazing to see what your body actually did and when sure. I played well what my body did versus not well and seeing why I need to strengthen the gym. And then it's my other favorite thing is going to the gym. So because I work at Athos right now and my boss makes me work around the <laughs> clock, I, I hope he is listening and maybe a, a raise for that, <laughs> is, uh, we don't get a lot of time to work out. So to make the most out of that time in the gym, that half hour, hour I have, and to be able to do my lower body workout when I use the shirt, the upper body workout, and automatically know if I did like a bench press, did I work my pecs the right amount? Um, was and it doing must be weight? huge for muscle balance too. Like you can realize huge. if one if one leg or one arm yeah. is really too much if or you, too little. If you see in my squats, you can see here how unbalanced I was to that right side. Yeah, mm -hmm. and. 
I, and that's know, huge for injury prevention, for, for rehabilitation, for all those things. For all those, and working out correctly. If you want to go, again, to squat example, you want to go do a squat in the gym, you know you want to work your quads and your glutes. If you're not working them correctly, or you're working one side more than the other, you're not going to get the intended yeah. benefit. And that's why coaches exist. And so our ability to help you, uh, to replace that and help you give that actual feedback is, is really what we're But it's hard. For. There's not a lot of people can actually eyeball you and know that you're disbalanced, you're unilateral, or something like that. And looking to be able to look at this and they go, look, I know that you're compensating right. and that's going to tear. You know, you've got yeah. to stop doing I that. Have a, you know, my, my very, oh, a year ago today, I was <laughs> at, I was doing, t getting taught how to do the demo. And my CEO is a brilliant guy, but not a trainer, uh, who said, do squats. I do my squats. I've done them <laughs> my whole life. I played soccer since I was two years old. Got this. Do it. He goes, are you right side bias? And I was like, no. And he was like, well, and he showed me, and I was at the top Surprise. training centers around, athlete performance, Gatorade, sports science, played at the highest level, and no one ever told me that. And I always had injuries on that left side because it was so underused. Yep. Oh, wow. And my CEO is a brilliant mechanical engineer, again, but not a trainer, was able to look at this in one second and we corrected it and it's helped me tremendously since. So I think that's a huge benefit we'll have is just getting people to work out correctly and seeing sure. results faster. That's crazy, I mean, it's a terrible thing to say. I can't get Kevin out of my head right now because <laughs> Kevin, our, our boss, he's living CEO, right, he's right called, here, Adam. Our friend, he's, he's so hardcore. I mean, he gets in these groups where he just goes to the gym and he wants to work out, you know, and he doesn't stop telling us how he likes to go to the gym and work right. out and then he tells us again. Um, but I mean, this is totally for him because then he can look at it and say, you know, I did this today, but I'm not doing it right, or I did he this He finally today, has web sure analytics right. for his body. Right, yeah. well, so that's just, I mean, thing. it kind of brings everything together. Like, I, yeah. I haven't really set foot in the gym ever, but I mean, yeah. I can definitely see this being beneficial because I don't know, I don't know, you know, the first thing about going and like what I should be doing and what yeah. I shouldn't be doing. So I feel like it could definitely help because I'd be able to see what I was doing right, what I was doing wrong yeah, and things like that. If you think about the gym now, and, and we store everything for you too. So I mean, everything, is, all your workouts are stored, um, every set. So if you see here, the little at the score we have, each mm -hmm. set is stored, you can go back and compare. So even if I do this and I just give you a little bit of that really quick. Um, I can go back and look at all my previous sets. Okay. Oh, the chat room everything. is asking about platform compatibility. You're showing it off on an iPhone. Do you, mm -hmm. Is it just iOS for now? Or? So right now we're just iOS. We will be Android in the future. We haven't really set a date towards that yet. Um, but we obviously, it's the majority of the market, but iOS is where we're going first going out. So um, <coughs> we, we get that question more than I think any other. <laughs> and uh, I'm always happy to see people frustrated about it because it means they want it. But it will happen in, in the future, for sure. And win it? Windows Phone? Uh, Windows Phone sometime after that. Okay. Yeah. I asked. I asked for everybody. Yeah. Is there I'm any kind sure of we'll uh, one Blackberry day. one day in the yeah. night? Yeah. No, no, no timelines on that. No timelines on that. Yeah. Maybe um, one day. Are there any kind of social things? So I mean, if I'm going to the gym and Renee's going to the gym and we're both doing the same kind of workouts, can I, you know, uh, can I make sure that everyone knows I'm better yeah, than Adam? Sure I'm going so we have a lot hardcore. of we have a lot of great um, features that we will be rolling into the app as as we go out and we get more of a user base to uh, compete against your friends. Okay. And because you're scored at the same level, right? So sure. if you do a squat, let's say you do a squat and Sidney Crosby does a squat. <laughs> if, if he does 200 pounds and you do 100 pounds, it doesn't matter because it's about muscle effort, right? Okay. And it, the whole the whole system's normalized to you. It's calibrated okay. to you. Very so cool. you can compare yourself not mm -hmm. against against me, against your friend, against Sidney Crosby, LeBron James, and be on right. the same level. So there's a lot of cool stuff we're going to oh, be rolling me, yeah. out. Uh, for right now, we have social Social, social share screens, excuse me. Tough, right? Yeah, where you can uh, <laughs> share any of your workouts Adam. out to uh, oh, any of the any social network, email, text. Say, hey, this was my squat. Okay. Um, cool stuff like that. But there's going to be some really cool comp competition elements that will be coming out in the future. And I imagine that beyond sports, maybe dancers would be interested in this. There, there, there might be a. We have been reached out to by anything and everything from workman safety to someone wanted dancers to wear this and to do an illustration across a screen for mm -hmm. like performing arts. Um, but there's so many use cases for it. We've been, uh, frankly, very flattered by, by the people that approach us. There's a number from Virginia, it's blocked. They say they need yeah. a bunch of units yeah. for people who need to be at <laughs> Not that, not for us, absolutely, <laughs> that's head down. But right now we're very focused on just fitness and just really disrupting the space and trying to provide uh, really valuable feedback to people. And we feel, you know, there's a lot of great things in the wearable space about reminding you to work out. You've sure. been sitting for this long, sit up straight, all that kind of good stuff. There's nothing out there that really provides actionable feedback to say, hey, this is what you just did, how to do it better. Mm -hmm. and, and we think that's a very valuable I saw it go by, I didn't catch the name, but HealthKit. Are you guys tying into HealthKit? Are you thinking about it? Yeah, we're thinking about it. There's no, there's no date set on it. Um, obviously, there's benefits, I think, for us doing it, um, but right now it's a focus of let's get the first release out, let's get the close out, and uh, and we'll go from there, um, and then figure out how to continue to give people the best experience. I'm, I'm sure it will happen one day. Are you guys actually internally competitive? Do you and your and the people in the organization share this kind of data yourselves? Yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, one of the great things about Athos is that everybody <laughs> is. Um, 
very, I would say, driven and competitive. There's not a lot of, I'd say, natural athletes in, in the company, <laughs> but uh, there's a lot of people who, who are very competitive in, of what they do, and, and we have people that come and do workout classes, we have a great fitness people on staff, we have great trainers that we work with, and so we're very fortunate we get kind of the top of the line, uh, I'd say, training feedback, sure. and we do compete against each other quite a bit, and it, and it bears itself out here, which is great. Do you have anything else on the pipeline? I mean, shorts, pants, are you going to do, you know, like gloves, hats, yeah, so socks? I mean, <laughs> great thing about the way the, the brilliant team back home has been able to engineer this stuff is that we can put the sensors in anything, sure. right? And so changing styles, changing colors, paired up versions, paired down versions, um, sports specific type of garments, all that stuff's possible. And He's and asking about speedos. It's <laughs> one, day. <laughs> one day, one day also, exactly, one day also. But uh, I'll pay you not yeah, to give him those. Fact, once, once you start your triathlons, we'll get Absolutely. you them, how about that? So you could even do, I mean, like team uniforms, my soccer team, something like that. Like yeah, yeah, the future, all this is possible as long as the sensors touch your skin. But yep. right now, it's it's again, it's these. Let's get them out the door sure. and perfect them. But um, we if know the NFL this calls, I think they'll answer it. Well, I don't know. If I start <laughs> picking up my NBA career again, I just want to know if I'll be able to throw these on. You know, have my team match. Yeah, and and, and yeah. you know what we display now is again for the user, for us to look at it. People like me and you who aren't trainers and aren't. Yeah. But uh, you're wearing them under space. your clothes now. You could basically wear whatever you want. You just have the shorts on underneath. Yeah. yeah, exactly. And and you know we expect guys to wear shorts over these. These are like Lululemon capris that girls would wear normally. Right. Um, but I've done press junk. I've done demos for partnerships in New York City running around the summer 90 degree weather with jeans on and these underneath and I've been <laughs> fine. So you can monitor yourself all day long if you want to. A little bit of John yeah. Williams music, you pull open the shirt. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly, exactly. Yeah, 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 it makes me look a little cooler than I am. That's the goal. Uh, Very cool. Uh, Jake, this is phenomenal. So uh, where can people find more information about this? If they want to pre-order, if they just want to know more about the product? Yeah, absolutely. So liveathos.com is the website. Um, also, Live Athos. Yeah, exactly. I'm not, I'm not even going to try And uh, same thing, that's our Twitter handle. That's Facebook, Instagram as well. But website has the best, uh, I would say, overall comprehension of explanation of the product. You can go pre-order there. You can ask us any question there. Please feel free to reach out. We'd be happy. We're very responsive. Get back to you guys quickly. And also, Facebook's a great channel to, to get a hold of us and see a lot of assets explaining the product product, video, um, all the press that we're getting. So check us out either place and please reach out. Awesome, thank you very much, Jake. Yeah, guys, cool. awesome, Jake, I appreciate thank you so it. Much. Thanks. All right, that was Jake from Athos. I am Renee Ritchie. I'm Adam Zeiss. This is CES Live and stay tuned. We have so much more coming your way. It could stun a team of mules. I don't know what he just said. Team of mules. We'll be back. <laughs>